Hi, welcome back. Welcome to this forecourt film for our 2008 BMW 335D Touring. This is the M Sport model. It's one of the very first of the, uh, the facelift models that came out in, in 2008. It's finished in stunning Le Mans blue, has beautiful oyster uh, D uh, Dakota leather, absolutely stunning condition inside and out. Uh, probably my favourite car that we currently have in stock. Uh, this was the top of the range for the diesel models when it came out. Um, in my mind, probably one of the best driving cars of, uh, of all of the three series that, uh, that they've had over the years. Absolutely stunning. Um, the condition is incredible. Uh, just two owners from new. It's been a, a local car. Uh, it's been maintained by the local BMW dealer at Barons in Hindhead. And uh, just having a quick look around it now, uh, there really isn't any sort of blemishes or marks to, uh, to point out to you. The car is in absolutely beautiful condition. Uh, all the wheels, all four wheels, all in uh, excellent condition. All have correct tyres on, all have the Bridgestone Potenzas. We have uh, eight millimetres of tread on the, on the front tyres and seven millimetres on the back, so they're pretty much brand new. We also have uh, brand new brake discs, front and back as well. Extremely well cared for car. With, uh, with absolutely nothing to do at all for the new owner. Uh, we just had it serviced last week. Uh, all it needed was uh, an oil change and uh, like I said, it's full, full BMW service history all the way through. Just having a quick look at the inside, uh, people that haven't seen these, um, these vehicles before, uh, it's a very, very useful feature on here. You can actually pop the rear window. Just helps to uh, just to uh, drop luggage in if you're in tight spaces or obviously you can open the, um, the main boot as well. Beautifully well looked after in here, lovely and clean, got all your tools and everything to the side, locking wheel nut and uh, as these are running run flat tyres obviously there's no spare wheel with the car so you do have this sort of additional handy storage area. The car's been upgraded with the storage pack so you have these luggage nets on the side, also things here to be able to put bottles in and things like that, um, and also uh, just sort of hooks for, for carrying plastic bags. Uh, we also have a uh, 12 volt socket in the back as well. Just close that down. Back of the car, absolutely stunning condition. No kick marks on the back of the seats, no scratches, no marks at all. Leather in absolutely perfect condition. Beautiful white stitching that sort of follows all the way along there. All of these headrests fold down independently as well, just to help with rear visibility. And if we come around to the front, again, beautiful leather continuing on the doors there, all in fantastic condition. The car's been upgraded with the piano black inlays that we see here. Makes the car look beautiful and modern inside. And again, just looking at the seats. No, pretty much zero bolster wear on the side there. We have a beautiful specification. The car's been upgraded with uh, electric memory seats for the driver's side. We also have the um, electronic lumbar support as well for driver and passenger, as well as the inflatable side bolsters that you get on the M Sport models. Beautiful three spoke M chunky steering wheel with the paddle shift and we also have automatic headlights and automatic windscreen wipers. Jumping in, the interior of the car has also been upgraded with a much sought after panoramic sunroof with the electric blind that runs all the way back. Sunroofs are tilt and slides op uh, option. And beautiful on a sunny day like this. Absolutely floods the interior with light. Probably one of the nicest interiors I've seen on these. Makes such a difference from just the sort of normal standard black leather. But again, just looking through here, you can see exactly how well cared for it has been. Mileage is 67,202. And if we come across here to the main screen, we have uh, the sort of media system. We have a DVD player on this main screen here, as well as the music collection, which is a, an onboard hard drive. Um, or you can also connect your external devices via, via um, auxiliary socket um, or via USB. All of these are located down here in the front center armrest. Also have all your controls for your radio, telephone, 
and obviously your satellite navigation as well. This is the, the widescreen professional sat nav, uh, covers you for all of Western Europe, extremely easy to use and um, uh, gives you sort of traffic updates and all that kind of stuff as well. So uh, yeah, absolute top of the range system on this one. Come through to vehicle information, this will give you uh, vehicle information about the um, any upcoming servicing that needs to be done. So we just pop into here now, we will see that the um, next thing that's due is a uh, MOT, which will be in October this year. Brake fluid service has just been done, that's uh, not due until January 21. Engine oil service due in 16,000 miles or in January 2021. 20, Vehicle check 2021. Front brake pads 24,000 miles and rear brake pads 26,000 miles. Again, those have all been done quite recently. So absolutely nothing for the new owner to uh, to spend any money on uh, until the first MOT, which is uh, which is due in in October. Uh, I think that sort of talks you through most of the specification that we've got up on here or through the iDrive. It's all controlled by this wheel down here. And this is the sort of the, the later generation that they um, they brought out um, along with the uh, the facelift for the car as well. Um, so like I said, absolutely stunning condition, unbeatable, a wonderful colour combination. Obviously the benefit of the panoramic roof and everything like that as well. Uh, and on the front of the car we also have the uh, adaptive Xenon headlights. Um, so these have the cornering lights on them, as well as the BMW Angel Eye LEDs that you can see here as the, uh, as the daytime driving lights. If we can help with any further information, please don't hesitate to contact us through our website, which is jajarvis.co.uk. We'd be more than happy to, uh, to help you with any further information uh, or value a part exchange for you, and ultimately get you down for a test drive, have a look at the car, and uh, we'd absolutely love to show it to you. Thanks very much again for watching, and we'll see you next time.